Alrighty, back at it again here with Agatha Fisty and where the hell am Dog meat. Dog meat. Dog meat, where did you bring me? Where did It's New Vegas, he actually did it. You son of a bitch! Welcome back, everyone, to more adventures of Agatha Fisty with her best friend, Idiot Dog. Who I now have to chase around to try and find Kellogg. So that's... so that that's exciting. I'm really thrilled to be putting my faith in this dog. Uh, well, let's go. Ooh, my interview's out. I would like to read that. View from the Vault, Part 1 by Piper Wright. Whenever I take a walk through Diamond City, there are so many things people tell me to be grateful for. Purified water, working lights, electricity, security. True, but what would have been unthinkable even a few decades ago? True, what we have would have been unthinkable. This is hard to read, Piper. I thought you had a printing press. But it's easy to forget that even after all the progress we've made, we are still living in the shadow of a world that was. A world before the threat of radiation, before the super mutant and the feral ghoul and the synth. So it's fortune, as fortune often has it, I crossed paths with Agatha Fisty, vault dweller, a person who is experiencing the commonwealth for the first time. What would hers, fresh set, what would hers, fresh set of eyes say? Piper needs an editor? About how far we've come. Is Diamond City the great green jewel we have always claimed to be? Before we begin to answer that, we have to know who Agatha Fisty is, where she comes from. She began our interview joking about her time, hers time in the vault. It was just me and a thousand guinea pigs. They turned carnivorous. Of course, this reporter knows that life behind the sealed door of a vault tech facility is actually supposed to be a bastion of the old world, a preservation before the bombs continued in part two. Piper's not that great. So what does Agatha Fisty have to say about seeing Diamond City for the first time? I've been having too much fun to blow things up to think about it. It's important to note that Agatha Fisty was not actually blowing things up at the time, and perhaps she was referencing the violence that is all too common when you're traveling outside the wall, often caused by herself. The more dangerous parts of the Commonwealth, blah 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 blah, how curious that her first reaction to the horrors and tragedies out there would be humor. You see, Agatha Fisty has a son, Sean. And even though they were the relative safety of the vault, someone broke in and took Sean from his parent, and that parent is now risking everything wandering through this strange and unfriendly world of ours in order to save Sean from his kidnappers. We all know the rumors and whispers that surround every missing person from Diamond City. Uh, the guilty looks we as we pass mourning members as we say, thank the wall, this time it wasn't us. You end up dead in the Commonwealth for a million reasons. Why spend our time worrying about kidnappings? Why indeed? It's easy for us to be cynical about the missing. We have spent so long knowing the Institute is out there, but understanding so little about them. They are not the only ones responsible for kidnappings, but the fact that they sometimes are, and the fact that they've been so powerless to stop them, we've been so powerless to stop them, causes us to treat all victims of kidnappings if they're a lost cause. But the people left behind, those loved ones, friends, and neighbors, we may never see the faces of those taken in the ga again. They do not have the luxury of being able to just look away. They have to carry that lost with them even if someone else tells them to move on and forget. I asked Agatha Fisty to make a statement to Diamond City, to give us an outsider's perspective on what it means to lose a loved one and how she feels. Maybe in some way it's how we should all feel. Maybe we've forgotten what, what the right human response to these tragedies are. Find who's responsible and make them pay, she said. And that's what we're doing. Dog, get back here. Dogman. Disco surgery party tonight. Dun 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 dun. Disco surgery party tonight. It's disco surgery party tonight. Dog, 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 dog. Follow a dog. Follow a dog. Follow a dog. Huh? Was that? One sec, dog meat. I just have to check on this obvious trap. <coughs> Goodbye. Oh, 
I fucked it up. There we go. Huh? Okay. Um, I'm just gonna follow you to the obvious trap. Is this the trap? Oh. Good, okay. As long as we found the trap. Anyone else? Yeah, Agatha doesn't respond well to chicanery. Did she just throw that guy by his junk? I'm pretty sure she just picked that man up by his penis and flipped him across the room. Which is pretty fantastic, honestly. I'm glad I fell for the obvious trap. There's a ton of stuff in here. What the- why are there bottle caps in the dryer? Ooh! Well, this is a basement of fun. I am not the first person that you tried this on. Why would you keep them inside? The smell! Like, it just seems like a bad idea. Ooh, picket fences. Excellent. I can build stuff at my settlements, which I'm never ever gonna do. Wine, whiskey, some ammo, Bobrov's best moonshine. Ooh, gonna save that for a special occasion. Vodka, Stimpak vodka. Make a Stimpak screwdriver. It's a, it, it's a Stimpak with vodka. It's not. Um, it's not like an amazing innovation in the in the world of post-apocalyptic cocktails, but you know, it's something. Alrighty. Oh wait, there's more vodka. More vodka. More stim. Another stim pack screwdriver. This is fantastic. Well, that was outstanding. Thanks everybody for your time. I appreciate you trying to pull one over on Agatha Fisty, but uh, I'll be on my way now. Right then, back to chasing this dog. Dog meat, lead on. Search for clues. What, here? Oh. Hey, look. It's, uh. A cigarette. It's a cigar. San Francisco go. Sunlights. Kellogg's preferred brand, alright. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? Definitely thought he was just going to tear into the lake. Oh, okay. Guess we're following the train tracks. Really? Like, try it, I guess. Anyone else? I'm gonna take that gold watch. It's mine now. Search for clues. Like this dead guy? Bloody bandages. Dog meat can track this. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? Alright. Yeah, I believe you. And now we travel overland. By rail. Are those other doggies? 
They are. I just punched the head clean off a dog. Doop a doop a doop. What I'm saying, dog meat, is, uh. I respect you. <laughs> and please lead me the right direction. Also, I did notice that I leveled up. What is that? Is that a Yaogwai? Oh, crap. I wonder if I can... Nope. No, I can't. Oh, boy. Well, this one's going a little better. Really trying to get away. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's bad. I was fine up until the Stingwing showed up. Alright, let's take that level before we have to fight a bear again. Uh, level 11? I don't think we get anything new at level 11 again. Maybe I just want more endurance. Ooh, actually damage resistance seems pretty good. Just general toughness. Take less radiation from eating and drinking. Yeah, let's just get tough. Alright, bear. Let's do it. But where is bear? I don't know where the bear is. There he is. Ah. Did not get sneak attack. Let's have... Some drugs. I just single handedly killed a bear. I mean, I only say single-handedly because Dogmeat doesn't have hands. Hey, this guy saw the whole thing. Wasn't that sweet? You saw that, hey? Did you see that? Hi. Excuse me, ma'am. Would you happen to know the way to Bunker Hill? Wait. Why do you need to go there? I can't divulge my reasons, but I need to get there urgently. Sorry, I don't. Yeah, it's all right. I'm sure I can find it on my own. Thank you anyway. So, first of all, you're nowhere near Bunker Hill. Secondly, hey, I need to get to Synth. Synth Institute. Obviously Synth, but I wouldn't know that. Agatha wouldn't wouldn't know that. Also, he's trying to get away from the institute, so I guess I won't just straight up murder him right now. But Synth. All right, dog meat, chill the hell out. Hey, a lame shack. What the, with the stairs? These are some involved stairs. Where does this go? Oh. A clue? Where? Clue! A decoy, huh? Clever. It's not that clever. It's He's got a stand on his feet. He's got like a... Uh, whatever. No one's gonna be like, oh yeah, that's totally a guy over there. Oh, did you already find what you needed, dog meat? Okay. Nice place. A few too many wrecked cars for my liking, but here we are. Whoops. Whiff!
What I like about the ghouls is when I can loot their bodies before they even hit the ground. Hello. No arms for you. I'm gonna go in here. No reason, I just feel like it. Ooh, I didn't expect that. Luckily, there's a stim pack inside. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! A legendary. Wow, he died right away. Martyrs enameled left metal arm. <clears throat> Martyrs left arm metal enam enameled martyr elm left metal. Temporarily slows time during combat. Is this better than what I have? We'll find out in a moment. In the meantime. Wow, that's way better than the metal arm I have now. Except, isn't the arm doing something? No, it's not. It's not doing anything. Okay, this one's way better. It's just statistically better, and also it slows time if I'm at 20% or less health. So, yeah. Switching that up. And you can't see it? You can't... It's the elbow spike? That's weird. All right. Let's go to somewhere where there's better lighting. Huh. All right. I quite like Agatha's aesthetic right now. It's the Grognak the Barbarian costume, and then just a completely haphazard mishmash of bits of armor and a, and a sea captain's hat. Just a sec, I want to see what this is. Oh. Okay, I don't know what that is. Goodbye. I don't care. I'll go back later. Dog time. Attention, assailant. Lower your weapons immediately. What? Alert. Critical signs. Alert. Critical signs. What have we here? Error. System corrupt. I can't feel my legs. Oh, they're right here. I can feel them for you. Did you feel that? Another one of his stogies. So Kellogg just like murderated an assaultron. It's pretty impressive. Oh. I'm gonna keep following you, dog. Bloat fly. Huh. Ugh. They're so gross. Hey, Yagwai. Where what? That way? Okay. What the? It's like the smallest red roach I've ever seen. Dogmeat's going off road. Do you have four wheel drive, Dogmeat? Doesn't look like you do. Are you trying to Skyrim this? Is that what's going on? Oh my god, a fence. What's this doing here? I should call Delilah. Lost the scent, boy? Dog me just giving up. Kellogg's still out there. You gotta track him, boy. Oh. I Did you manage to intersect your body with the fence? See, this is what I was afraid of. This is why I have trust issues with you, Dogmeat. Are you actually taking me to Kellogg? Or are you just... You don't even know where you are. Ugh. Here. What do you think, boy? Garbage huh? rags. Is this our man? Well... Now we're here, wherever this is. Fort Hagen. Alright. Oh, is this where we're going? Is this the place? Huh? Is he in here, boy? Because this is kind of boarded up. 
Find a way to Fort Hagen. Alrighty. Well, let's get inside this building then. Ah, I hear the telltale whirr of some machine gun turrets. Sadly for them, I have superpowers. Ah. Hmm. That's odd. Usually I can get them. Oh, well, here we are. Got him. Got him. So this is going well. That one wasn't even shooting at me. I just felt like future-proofing. Well, no wonder the vents never got fixed. Gary just went up to the roof and died. Dog meat, do you know how to how to get in here? Oh wait, it's right here. It's 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 here. Dog meat, I found I found it. It's right. It was right here the whole time. Okay. Yeah. Oh ho! Is it synth the clock? I think it is. Waffles the cat will be avenged this day. I mean, not completely. It's the start of a long vengeance campaign. Let's let's put it that way. Hello. Hi. I'm here for vengeance. Uh, my scanners must be malfunctioning. Yeah, they're probably not though. Hi. Blam. Wub ammo. You guys suck. Well. Yeah, except that you suck. So, you know, there's that. Looks like there's still a couple of you guys downstairs. Make peace with whatever metal god runs your life. Let's just activate the Protectron and get a little backup, I think. Whoops, whiff. Who throws a Molotov cocktail? Oh, I do. I did that. That was me. I'm sorry. I got very excited. That That's on me. Ooh, my arm is a little crippled. I guess I just... I see you guys, and I start throwing Molotovs. That's how I dealt with you last time. It worked out pretty well then. Hey, what's up? Hey, Protectron. Come with me, because there's another guy over here. Oh, it's a laser turret. I don't know how I'm supposed to hit that. Oh, hey, that worked. Oh, what? Why is the Protectron pissed at me? I didn't do anything to you. Oh, well. Hey. Hey! And then he just fell over. All right, sure. You know what? I don't care. Dog meat, are you... Uh, you'll catch up. That's right, you're all going down. Ah, buarbub floor. Wah, dog me how the how do you do this always? Oh, 
Really? Because I'm still not... Oh, hey. Hi. Now you have no arms. Ha 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 ha, idiot. It's not quite like... You know... It's not quite as elegant as now I have a machine gun, ho ho ho. But... Now you have no arms, idiot, ha 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 ha. Is, you know, it has its own sort of... Je ne sais quoi. I kind of like that sometimes I'm jamming the melee button so frantically that Agatha just gets upset and hawks a Molotov. <laughs> Maybe I should not do that. Oh well, here we are. Oh, you know what this calls for. Let's just crush an entire bottle of whiskey all at once. Let's do it, here we are. Pulse grenades, I like pulse grenades. Ooh, what was this? Yeah. Heals. I like healing. I can pick the locks. Doop, boop, 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 boop. I had all the whiskey. Gamma rounds and railroad spikes. Nobody understands what the fuck's going on. Alright. Agatha the fisty, sneaky, sneaky granny. Sneak, 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 sneak. Boom. Sneaky, sneaky, sneak, sneak. Agatha. Sorry, is your house has been a wreck for 200 years. I don't need a roommate. Leave. I'm not gonna leave. Don't, don't tell Kellogg. But I'm, I'm actually not. I'm actually not gonna leave. He's like, you should leave, and I'm like, no. N uh, I, I'm not gonna. But don't don't tell him yet. Is I want it to be a surprise. Shut up. Shh, shh, shh. Hey, Kellogg. I mean, no. Shush. God, I was surprised. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Never expected you to come knocking on my door. Gave you 50-50 odds of making it to Diamond City. After that, figured the Commonwealth would chew you up like jerky. Hey, shut up. You don't know that I'm here. I'm a surprise. Movement, huh? What kind of movement? Like this? Oh, that's that little punching combination? Deal with me now. I can't see. There we go. Was that the kind of movement that you thought you might have heard? Was that was that it? Because guess what? You you did. Look, you're pissed off. I get it. I do. But whatever you hope to accomplish in here, it's not gonna go your way. Well, what if what I hope to accomplish is that I kick your ass? Because that that I think I think that's gonna go my way. Security gate, novice, deal with me. Open up, open up, open up, open up. No, nope. try it again. Open, open, fisty. Da 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 da. Money, 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 cash. And a camera. Don't care. Money. Whatever. Ooh, heals. Give. Yes. Pack of blood. Just gonna have some hundred year old blood. Mm mm mm. Agatha's this a vampire. A vampire, and she's a the predator, and she's a drunk <laughs> at present. Uh, how am I gonna deal with that laser turret? I guess just run up and punch it. Ooh! Wow! Body slam! No! No! Body slam results in seizures. Why? Let's try that again. Anyone else? Bring it. Actually, 
Rat away. Don't mind if I do. And Rat X. Oh, this is great. And a stim pack. A surgical tray. Oh, hey, the lunch room. How much right away do I have? Ah, uh, you know what? I can probably get rid of that little bit of radiation that I got going on. Hey. There we go. Ooh, critical damage with energy weapons. That will never be relevant for me. All right. More explosives. Please, yes. Got it. Grenade and two cocktails. Mm-mm, cocktails. Hi. Surprise. Found you. Um... No, you didn't find me. I found you, and then I killed you. So, deal with that. Ooh, armory password. Yes, please. I bet this military facility has really cool spiked Hello. knuckles. Maybe I should have saved my critical. Oh well. It's not too late. Stop. Turn around. You have that option. Not a lot of people can say that. Yeah, that's not that's not happening. Now, what's in the armory? Heels. Rad X. Bobby pins. A toolbox. That's it. Nothing in the toolbox I care about. A couple stim packs. Dog meat standing on boxes like he shouldn't be able to. <laughs> and what have we here? Bullets, 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 a laser rifle, a fat man. Yes, please. A mini nuke, fusion cells, fusion cells. That's it. I'm going to be able to sell that fat man for a lot of money to buy healing items because I keep getting my ass kicked. Ooh, what's this? U.S. Covert Operations Excellent. Manual. <gasps> yes. More difficult to detect while sneaking. And some vodka. Beer in the shower, huh? Kellogg's a beer in the shower kind of guy. Didn't know that. It's kind of a crappy place to be living. Alright, I think we have successfully scavenged. Let's heal up. Let's have some blood. And Instamash. Oh, there's more stuff. More purified water. Pack an addict all. Oh, interesting. That's actually a institute med kit. I'm only recognizing it now because I played through the game Sweet. later. Like I've played through the game on my other uh, character. Still finding a lot okay. of new stuff though. You made it. I'm just up ahead. My synths are standing down. Let's talk. I'm not standing down, but that's fine. I'm going to murder you, I hope. This might take a couple tries. So, here we are. Funny, huh? End of the line, Kellogg. You die. And I get my son back. You can turn around right now. Go back the way you came. Sean. Well, besides being a bit older than you were expecting, I'm afraid he's not even here. 
So you see, it is the end of the line. Not the way you imagine. Uh, I believe this is a call for a... Fuck you, Kellogg. Let him go. Your time's done. Your son is exactly where he belongs. He's home. In the Institute. The Institute? Well, I'll find him no matter where he is. Nothing will stop me. God, you're persistent. I give you credit. It's the way a parent should act. The way I'd be acting if I were in your place, I like to think. Even if it is useless. But I think we've been talking long enough. We both know how this has to end. Yep. So, you ready? In a hundred years? Didn't. I sort of cut the cool line off. That wasn't what I meant to do. Oh well. Uh, now then, let's see here. I wanted to get this. Yeah. Ooh, I'm addicted to chems. Eat it, Kellogg. Oh, is there more of you? I'm sorry. Well, that went pretty well. Cybernetic brain augmenter. All this tech. You were barely human. Actually, I'm going to take your outfit, too. Just for funsies. That went pretty darn well, considering. Healing was this. Perfect. Robco Fun. The Pit-Boy holotape game. Don't care. Kellogg's Terminal. Let's use this unreadable computer. The boy, Sean, successfully delivered back to the Institute. Payment received. New orders are to track down Renegade. Gather reinforcements. Cleared out security Fort Hagen. We move out soon. Well, alright. Oh, good. Some Addictol. That's good. Since I just became addicted to chems. I actually don't know how chem addiction manifests in Fallout 4. I've never had it happen. Well, I guess we'll find out together. Well, on my way to punching everything in the Institute into a bloody stump. Er, wait, no. Punching it so my arms would be... Well, no, my arms aren't going to be bloody stumps. I'm going to punch everything in the Institute until it turns into a pile of robot parts. And I will be bloody... Well, there's humans there, too, so... They'll be bloody. Okay. I'm going to go to the Institute... Humans rendered bloody piles. Robots rendered piles of electronics. Agatha will probably hurt her fists in the process, but then she can recuperate somewhere nice afterwards. Okay, we got there, everybody. We did it. All right, that was... Um, hello. So... I feel like... I want... to punch them also. Yeah. Yeah, I, I want to do that. So... That's probably good for this episode, then. We killed Kellogg. Because he's a son of a bitch. And now the Brotherhood of Steel has shown up. 
And uh, next episode, we're gonna be we're gonna be chasing the Pridwin. I know it's called the Pridwin. It's meant not. It's meant to be a secret. Well, it's not meant to be a secret, but I'm just not supposed to know yet. So yeah, thank you all for watching, and we will talk to you next time on the further adventures of Whoa, the Pridwin's glitching out. Look at it. It's glitching out. Oh no. Got to get there. Got to chase it. Get, get over the fence. No. Eh. There we go. Okay. Look at it. That's crazy. I don't know if I, I don't think I'm going to be able to catch it. All right. Well, we'll do something. The point is Agatha Fisty will ride again next time with more people to punch and a whole new faction to punch. An entire new faction of people to punch into bloody pulps or piles of circuits or whatever. Constituent parts. I'm rendering them into constit... Thank you for watching and um, check out our Patreon at patreon.com slash loadingreadyrun because it brings us all the things that we do and um, I'll work out a better way to say... Okay. She's going to be punching them into their...